What's giggity good? Just got back from a crazy Ron's barbecue. You feel me? You feel me? Do you feel me? Oh, yes. Bizarre Vlog 101. What's giggity good? So, we're gonna start off with this delicious looking meal. This is what we call delicioso. Muy delicioso. Yup. Yup. Look at the mac and cheese back there. Oh, mac and cheese. Wow. Amazing. And then you got the okra. The fried okra. And then you got some white bread back there. You feel me? Real the lemonade, and we're watching the brink, half cocked. You feel me? You feel me? What's giggity good bizarre vlog 101 class is now in session. How y'all doing today? So first off, I'm going to introduce you to myself. My name is Debbie Morris. I am from Earth, as you may have known, as everybody else is here too. But since we're doing introductions, I just wanted to start with that. Okay, so today is a special day. It is January 17, 2020. Y'all know what that means. A special game just dropped. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Yup. Yup. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot just dropped, and you know I wasn't wasn't even planning on getting this game until today, until today, because I was watching this one reviewer. His name is Dreamcast Guy. If y'all know him, check him out. But I've never seen him besides a couple games. Usually, new games he don't give it a good score. He don't even give it a score. Most games I even see, he don't even give them a score. He said, it's bad, don't buy it. But this one, he gave it an 8 out of 10. Okay, so the things, I, I didn't even care about the score. I was caring about the things that he was saying. Now, he was throwing in hardcore RPG. He kept saying RPG. And then they got a new, they got a new system on here where instead of leveling up, each individual character, you individual, you you level him up, and then you can select what kind of attributes and stuff. It's like a big leveling system, crafting system. You feel me? I wonder if you can just change the clothes real, like, like take off Piccolo's cape and stuff like that. Can you uh, change up Vegeta's attire and stuff like that? You feel me? And Hey, we're going to bust it open right quick. You feel me? We're just going to bust it open right quick. So I'm going to pull out one of my knives. You feel me? You feel me? We're going to bust it open. And I'm going to tell you what's in there. Alright, so we did our precision cuts, you feel me? That's the most important part about this. You gotta make sure you're doing your precision cuts. Alright, so when you open it up, you just open it up like a book, you feel me? Look at that. Juicy. Right out of the cover, you feel me? Look at it. Right out of the cover. Yeah, it's no magic tricks involved, I'm just that nice, you feel me? So. You know, then you can decide what you want to do with this, you know. You can fold it back up. It's a multitude of things you can do for this, you know. You can even have an exhibit for an animal or insect or something like that, you know what I'm saying? Just have them just chilling, you feel me? Like a ladybug or something like that, yeah, you feel me? So, um, that's this right here. You feel me? You know, luckily, 
I don't have, I'm rich. You feel me? Luckily, I'm rich. But I can sell this right here for over $25. You feel me? But I don't need the money like that, so we just gonna throw it away. You feel me? All right, man, we gonna unbox it, bruh. What? Look, bruh, it don't even have any manuals or nothing in it, bruh. Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? Okay, so, this is the disc, you feel me? This is the disc, pretty simple, just Goku on the Cloud Nimbus, you feel me? So, um, we're gonna go ahead and install it, and we're gonna go ahead and cut to the next clip. Look at this cooking ball. You hear the sound ball? You hear the sound? Look, I'm gonna let y'all just, y'all gonna hear it, bro. Y'all gonna hear it. Y'all gonna hear it. We're gonna put just a little, you know, we can't go all vegan. We gotta put some chicken and dope on that bit. You feel me? You feel me? We ain't going all vegan. Never go full vegan, bro. You know, we gonna almost get, you know, we almost gonna, no, so, no, gonna add salt to food, bro, during cooking. Let's go on something. All right, put that pepper on that ball. Hey, look at that ball. Gonna transform the dish, boy. Hey, somebody tell me. Say, say, transform the dish. All right, man. Now I gotta put my special blend in that ball. Gonna put them sesame seeds in that ball. Gonna put them in there now. You feel me? They get integrated. So they ain't just popping out the blue, you feel me? You just, you see them in there. Alright, these okra is done now. It's not overdone, it's done. Okay. So, this is the okra. You feel me? It's a fine article okra. Everybody can make it. Yeah. I'm gonna put them on there. Funny mom, yeah. I'm gonna show y'all the fine. Yeah. Hey, boy, y'all gonna see everybody like vegan crab, boom, vegan, vegan crab. I'm gonna eat it. Ain't no crab in here. Like, how is the crab? Hey, man, y'all wanna have vegan everything else? Y'all got this one. <laughs> if y'all watch it. Bruh. This is so delicious, man. I ain't eating it yet. The mushroom colored, you feel me? We got it on four right now, you feel me? Wait, hold on. We got it about on six right now. Turn it up to about seven. All right. So we're doing good right now. Hot so chill. Oh yeah, she look bam. See, look. Now we're at the door. Now we're at the door. All right, we're gonna do the vegan crab boy check in. This is what we're looking like now. Are oh, you feeling me? Yeah. This is what we got left to add today. And then, you know, drinking on the IPA, you feel me? I'm gonna drink the whole, I'm gonna drink the rest of this little. I had a mixed drink I'm making, but I'm gonna drink the rest of this for y'all, you feel me? Phantom IPA, hey, by this point, is one of my favorite companies that make beer. They from San Diego. When I was in the military, I was very familiar with Ballast Point. You feel me? I was drinking them on the weekly. I probably spent, I probably spent a good about two, two or three thousand dollars on some beer when I was in the military, which is not a lot for most people. Some people spend that much in a year. You feel me? In the Marine Corps. But I got my fair share of drinking some high PAs. When I was out there. Alright, let's go ahead and do another check. Swish. Alright. Okay, it's getting a little soft now, you feel me? You don't want you don't want your, your meal to get soft, so 
When it gets out, turn up the hat. Put the pressure on. Put the pressure on. That's when you can take these other green, green onions in too. Get them all put it in right now. While everything's still gonna be percolating. It wasn't, they weren't, the green onions weren't shooting in the gym, you feel me? The green onions was not shooting in the gym. But, you know, we're gonna let them slide. We are going to let them slide. Alright, garlic, you feel me? In case you're a vampire or something, put a little bit, because, you know, a little bit of garlic will help a vampire, but a lot of garlic will kill. You feel me? Y'all bet y'all hating. If y'all ain't making the dish with me, y'all hating. Greek seasoning, you feel me? For all my all my paternities and sororities out there, you feel me? Put some of that Greek seasoning on there. I hope y'all get mad. I hope I don't have to join you no, know, do no readings or nothing for using this Greek seasoning. But you feel me? We here, we here. I do not affiliate with no paternities and sororities. I have not joined no pro program. I ain't even thought about it. Cause that's not me. I already joined the sorority. I'm a fraternity. So sorority is the Navy. Fraternity is the Marine Corps. You feel me? Talk to them. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and play the on for him. I know y'all waiting to play the on for him. Cause y'all wanna see me go to Stone Mountain. We here, what, five minutes? This could be a whole nother. Actually, this one will be called Cooking with Debbie Morris. So this ain't gonna be the Stone Mountain video. This could be a whole nother video. I gotta move my rice cooker out because if they get if they get burnt anyway, I'm gonna be devastated, bro. Mm -hmm. For the time being, I'll be devastated. Every time I look at it, I'll be like, damn. I remember when I pulled up that time. I'll probably try and buy a new one or something. Alright. Looking delicious. Look man, you gotta make sure the okra not being encroached upon. They need their own space, you feel me? Alright, we in the game, bro. Oh, y'all see this whole picture, bro? Yeah. We in the game, bro. Alright, so. I'm gonna actually clean up after after I get done eating. I plan on eating both plates. BTW. <laughs> you feel me? All right, put some more pepper on that bit on top of it, just for the hell of it. You feel me? Well, this meal right here, bro. This a meal. This a meal. This a meal. Cooking with that mom. The mushrooms is gonna be the crab meat, you feel me? You feel me? You gotta take an L somewhere. The mushrooms is the crab meat, you feel me? And the shrimp is gonna be the radish. The onions is uh, octopus, you feel me? Hey, this how you, this how you gotta do when you're a vegan. If you don't, you know, cause I'm trying to convert back to being a vegan. And I ain't gonna cap, it's hard. Cause I had ate some hot dogs the other day ago. Cause I'm like, man, I gotta eat some hot dogs, man. But I'm trying to be a vegan though, so I'm gonna give it a shot, bro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to give it a shot. It just involves me cooking. I'm just gonna have to cook more. You feel me? Instead of microwave and shit or buying some shit from the stove. You feel me? And did I even finish my drink? I did.
Thank you guys for watching. Let's cook him with them more. If y'all want to see the other dish, you feel me? Cause this one got the this one got the okra more open. You feel me? You can really see the okra right here. You feel me? The okra. This gonna be the swordfish. You feel me? The swordfish. We got many swordfish right here. You feel me? Every time you eat swordfish, you feel me? So the Brussels sprouts. That's gonna be the oysters. You feel me? With a big ass oyster meat. You feel me? So you just gotta be creative with it. But that's my episode. Thank you guys for watching.